Dear Lord, as I take a walk this morning, I cannot believe that today is the day. I'm reminded of my life's journey, where I come from and where you have taken me. You have always been there and you have carried me all the way. Thank you, Lord. I am immensely grateful. Thank you for this day. Thank you for the opportunity. May you continue to carry me daily and protect me with your higher power. You are God and God alone. You are good. Father, you are the greatest provider. You are kind and loving. You are everything that is good and more. Forever I'll praise you and worship you. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are good, safe, and blessed abundantly. My name is Namani Nakubu. I'm trying to find a good lighting. Yes, my name is Namani Nakubu, and I welcome you to this channel. Ciao. I'm starting a new vlog. Um, I'm sure for by now, um, you'd have seen me take my morning walk, and I'm just thanking God and praising God. Um, for all he that he has done for me. I am so grateful. I am beyond Oh God, I'm beyond excited. I am beyond 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 excited and I just thank God that finally it has happened to me you know, um, finally God heard my prayers and finally he decided that, you know what, my child, it's, it's okay, lead us, um, yeah, you know, go, go, go and have what you want, you know, um, yeah, guys, should I come closer? <laughs> come a little closer, um, yeah, so, um, <laughs> By the time you see this, I will be enjoying it. It will be like months, not months, weeks, or I don't know, I don't know. But I'll see when I post this. Um, yeah, so are you ready for it, guys? Are you ready for it? <laughs> Ciao. You are definitely not ready for this. So, 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 um. I don't even know. I'm, I'm so teary saying this. Um, oh God, thank you so much, um, guys, guys, guys. I, 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 me, hello, hello. Uno malungi lo makubu child has finally, finally bought herself a car child <laughs> yeah i know like now it sounds like i'm not happy or whatsoever but guys you know, my heart is jumping for joy my heart is jumping for joy so um everything has been finalized now actually today i got the news that um, everything is ready for me tomorrow i need to um come and pick my car up hallelujah jesus um it was a really eye-opening um walk or journey right and um it 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 just showed me good girl you have grown child like you know you're making big decisions now like big financial decisions and having to compare insurances your child having to negotiate your deal you know but in any case i thank god for helping me and oh my my word after four years is it 2020 i started working in 2020 like proper proper working in 20, late 2020 so 2021 2022 20, 20, 20, 24 literally well it's three years and some months but this year actually actually in july it's gonna mark um four years of me being employed and only now am i buying myself a car 
child. <laughs> I think um, I, I needed a car or it finally hit me that girl, you need a car, you know, um, in, when was it? When I lost my Anglo job or UP job in 2022, June, right? And um, yo guys, it was the most emotional day or, or like the worst day of my life since I existed because, or since I've become actually independent, you know, yo, because um, now emoto by Tatile, like now I need to pay rent now, like reality hits reality hit and i was like oh my gosh right i'll show you guys a video um or insert a video of when i dropped off that car i remember it was a it was a, a rio a kia rio yo i loved that rio i i treated it as as if it was my own all the cars actually from 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 thing from blue you know that was rented for us i treated them like they were my baby and yeah after that yo guys i needed a car so oh, thank you Lord. it has all been you and it's still gonna be you thank you so much and yeah now i need to take this baby back oh i'm gonna miss this baby oh literally this baby carried me through all <laughs> near kumbula buddies buddies oh. This baby carried me through all. I'm gonna miss this car. Yo, Lord. I'm gonna miss you, baby, and I love you. I always talk to this car. This car's name is Rio. All the cars that I've driven, the company cars, I've given them a name. But the last time I was heartbroken that Apollo is leaving, but now I'm heartbroken that this one is leaving because this one i have experienced it through all we had many incidents together i was driving at nights with it moving with my clothes yo ah what a journey so yeah guys this is it this is it my rio 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 ah oh. This is the last time that I'm seeing these people. <laughs> yeah, buddies. Um, yeah, so I'm at the blue, just doing final touches and everything. Oh, I have a pimple here that's living rain free. I'm doing final touches and then I'm gonna go. I don't even know where the taxis are, but I'm just gonna ask the guy at the back. Yes, in the local booty, I'm at the taxi. I go pick on Jay. Yeah, I'm not gonna leave Willaba. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Time, I really couldn't afford it because number one I was paying off for my mom's house so those who don't know I think I've never said this I bought my mom a house in 2022 right beginning of the year and um, <laughs> <laughs> but in any case um, yes and so because obviously it was a loan so I had planned for myself that I will pay it off in December, so I put in January, December I was gonna pay it off, and yo, yo, not the, not all good, it was the worst year of my life, but it was the, it was a nice paying off that house. But in any case, I'm grateful to God that I could do that, you know, for my parents, and um, I love them so much. I'm like, um, my stepdad, my mom. Yo, if they are watching this, I love you guys so much and thank you so much for everything that you guys have done for me. That house was simply a um, gratitude, right? And um, me just saying thank you and saying that, um, yeah, thanking God for you guys. And yeah, so yes, 
back to the story I was paying it off and um, then I finished it oh then I lost my job in junior guys yo that was the worst time of my life literally because I was so stressed the only thing basically I was stressed about is paying off the um, that loan right and because i was also still young i didn't know what this insurance you can actually in your contract you can include retrenchment stuff blah, 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 blah. i didn't know that and i didn't have that plan or didn't have that insurance so um i yeah so i find i had to pay it off but luckily god was just amazing i lost my job in okay my job my contract ended 30 june and then on the first week of July, literally, I got another job. And I was like, thank you, Jesus. Yeah, okay. But in any case, yeah, I, I got that job. And yeah, I continued paying. Coming 2023, I t had told myself, girl, you need a car. You need a car. And um, I need to go buy myself a car. So 2023, I planned because I'm going to buy the car. But due to unforeseen circumstances and, you know, all it was all in God's plan, in 2022, again, I got another job in KZN, then I got another job in Gauteng, um, <clears throat> then I moved to this side, right? And then my boyfriend bought a car, which um, the main reason for him buying the car was for me to use it right because i well my interview or my job required me to have a car and i said that i am on but like i am busy with that so yeah so fortunately enough um i got the job and i um my, my boyfriend bought his car and i used the car and oh my gosh i also cannot thank him enough for that um like yo he was he was using a taxi and i i i i was using the car monday to friday so like yo that was a really huge sacrifice for him and i thank him so much for that and then it was bought in september right and in november i got an accident right um i don't know if i still have those photos for that but um like there was one time where I deleted it from my phone, but I'm gonna ask him if he still has it. Um, simply because it was just the worst time of my life, and um, we didn't have he didn't have a short cover insurance. So obviously now, because I also feel guilty, you know, and stuff like that. Even though he wasn't, even though um, someone hit me from the back, it wasn't actually my fault, but um we had to pay the shortfall and it was quite a long it was quite a lot of money but um then we uh, managed to pay it off and then yeah i went a little bit back with my savings but in any case it was fine so 2023 i could not buy a car yeah pay like in 2023 and yeah and also another reason is that 2022 and moved right to a new apartment this apartment and obviously it was a bigger space and nicer you know like that so i had to buy furniture and we know that furniture guys is not not cheap <laughs> so i had to focus on that um i couldn't afford focusing on furniture and car child no i couldn't do that but in any case at the end of the day i did it um and then i was like you know what i'm gonna then a car was just further from my mind which actually makes sense you know the thing that you say with your mouth it actually does work you know i remember the time i was still in anglo right and the time you know we had cars and everything another colleague of mine was like why don't you buy a car and i was like what a car no guys i already have a car the company car was referring to that and i was like you know what a car is not in my plan for the next five years and they to like this year it's closer actually to five years well it's getting into four years but like you know four and five is so closer so actually being it right but in any case um yeah so yeah then 20 end of 2023 i was like you know what because my savings also were like not where i wanted to be and i was like you know what 2024 i'm going to build my savings right i planned on that and 
honestly if i have to have a car right i need to have a savings for it right well for me this is me i don't believe in myself buying a car or me buying a car yet i have zero savings for that car or zero savings for you know um if something had to have to happen to me or happen to my job or something like that i don't believe in that so i had to work hard for my personal savings for my um car savings and also for my rent you know like just to be covered you know one thing that um life has told me when it comes to dates and everything is that um you need to have an emergency account right and i didn't have that i wish i knew that when i started working right and um yeah also i, I did mention emergency funds i also wanted to build that and um yeah so that if anything has to happen i know that i you know have something and because i'm now so independent like okay like uh, it's not the nicest thing but any case um life happens i understand you know what is mean my phone switched off while i was recording but any case i need to hurry up because um i have uh, something to do but any case as i was saying that i don't believe in um like not having savings in, in life because life has taught me that you always need to need to be safe in for rainy days because if you don't have an emergency account then whenever you need something right you're gonna go for a loan or you're gonna go for somewhere else you know where they charge you interest and in this economy child the interests are just like a rocket high especially if it's a fight a, pen, a, a personal um personal loan you're right so um yeah so um i told myself you know what um actually from end of november or october i started with my financial savings um while well, adding up because not like i didn't have anything but it was it was really low guys honestly but any case yeah i started with that and then i told myself 2024 i'm gonna be so much disciplined like literally i'm gonna be so much disciplined and i did you guys it was not the easiest thing because you take like a chunk of money out of your salary and save it and you're just looking at it um yeah but any case um i'm grateful to god that I, I got to do that and yeah shame um and then and then now this is happening yo guys i yo, child i don't know i don't know but i'm yeah before i cry um i'm so grateful i'm so grateful to god for this opportunity right um i need a car i needed a car or like those who know me like my friends um my family they know how much i needed a car and also because um where i stay like there's no taxis that passes here so i was using e uber for the longest time and also my boyfriend used to or well, not used to gives me his car to go to work because it's better now you know he's working from home so yeah and yeah thank you so much um like you he's such a helping hand and um yeah guys i'm so grateful and i can't wait to show you guys the car <laughs> even though i'm so scared like i'm so scared to share my personal space even like that's why you guys even actually have not have or had a, a house tour you just only see when i do videos and stuff like that because like in Gazara, you know um I, i'm also not sure if i want to reveal the car but in any case it's okay you guys will know or when you saw one you know through my videos but in any case um yeah and i'm so grateful guys i'm really 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 grateful and this is a sign to you or a motivation to you that god's timing is perfect god's timing is um is, is beyond us you know we must just keep on praying and um, trust in him you know because also um, our situations are not the same you know sometimes I used to compare myself with um, other people at work especially right because yo look at their them you know like um, they 
um they just started working like two months and then they buying themselves a car buying themselves a house like that will that that used to hurt me a lot but then um i, I like I, I found strength in god to say that you know our situations are not the same and our destiny is not the same and um like we don't know what that person has to had to go through and sometimes they just born like that you know like like kaigibo they are well off and stuff like that and they can do the, these things for themselves you know but yeah um but what's important for for what was important for me or what i've learned is that i must always be grateful and always appreciate um the things that i have or appreciate the um uh, uh my current situation you know um yeah 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 let me stop <laughs> and so that you guys can watch um the rest of the video but in any case thank you guys so much for the support and now you should actually there's a more reason for you to subscribe and comment and you know so that i can be able to pay off for this car child <laughs> and then yeah but in any case thank you so much for to everyone thank you so much to my family thank you so much to my colleagues actually who helped me with, like with transport and everything yo i cannot thank them enough they won't believe when they show when i show them my car like i cannot thank them enough guys there's this colleague of mine who stays around here she used to like she didn't mind like dropping me off and she's like when i was paying I was like no child it's okay you know like yo i don't know what i'll, I'll buy her you know like but at the end of the day i just pray that god blesses her i pray that god meets all her needs i cannot do a big thing for her even though i wish but like i just trust god that's something big y'all um yeah so all my colleagues actually who were giving me lifts and um yeah my family my boyfriend my friends thank you guys so much i honestly appreciate it and yeah let's just get straight into the video chat let's go chat let's go get my car here's my ootd i'm gonna be wearing heels not these shoes but let's go get my car chat let's go get my car Let's go get. Did you take the thingy? Um, mm -hmm. What else, buddies? We are getting nearer and nearer. <laughs> Jesus. The first song that I'm going to be playing in my car is this one. This one. Ngoba kwenze kile, kwenze kile, ni kamaliga cheese. So yeah. Anyway, it's up to you. from Sheen and I said it was for a special um thing <laughs> I didn't say but yeah this was it it was for my car guys oh my word so I am back from the dealership oh my word I'm so happy guys I literally can see my car let me do this i literally can see my car there my car my car <laughs> i literally can see and i'm so happy it looks so beautiful oh <laughs> i love it i like it but any case buddies thank you so much for watching this vlog i truly honestly appreciate it Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. You can say congratulations or you can say anything. But thank you guys so much. 
I'm so happy. Um, it is a weekend. Fortunately, it's a weekend, and but I still have things to submit. But it's okay. I'm gonna enjoy my car nonetheless. Um, yeah, I can't wait to go home and show them. I can't wait to your child. I can't wait to um, yeah, show my mom, show my grand, go home. You know. So I planned that I'm gonna be taking leave um, next week, well, not next week, but the other week. Um, I'm gonna be taking leave, and I'm gonna be going home to show my granny, my car. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm gonna go to my mom on Wednesday. Yeah, this Wednesday that we're going to, and yeah, we'll see how what they say. But in any case, thank you so much, buddies. Um, I'll see you guys on the next vlog. Bye.